thing kind of stressful somehow. Like, the guy had certain plan in order, and I was like, worried about not following the plan right. Even though it's just a fucking Sentinax farm. You know? Ugh. I don't handle the slightest bit of expectation or pressure well. I just crumble. <sighs> so I have to... I'll read that again. As you may or may not recall, I once helped young paladins obtain their first armored mount. It was a tedious task that involved spending months, and that involved months of obtaining materials and sending them all over Azeroth. Thankfully, uh, times have changed, and we now have most of those materials at hand. That being said, I wish that uh, I wish to help you obtain a new mount, something worthy of your title as High Lord. In order for us to begin, I only require that you obtain a barding for us, something strong, thick, and heavy. No, High Lord, your cock does not work for as a barding. Uh, I choose to believe that's what he said. Okay. I really hope that's on the auction house. Stone high leather barding. For some reason, I thought I I'd forgotten to come to him earlier. So no, in that case, I'll just go up this way. I wish there was a portal to Dalaran in, you know, non-Stormwind. That would be nice. I need to go record more Durakar. Might do that in a moment. Um, Christ, I have plenty of this. I've nearly 300 of them. 300 of them. Like, my god. Let's do a full scan. I feel like I really should go and get the uh, all those blueprints. Not for any reason beyond just having completed it. Any day now, Optioneer. My mind is getting distracted here. Uh, my commentary is going out the window. It's just like my mind is like drifting. It's uh, you know out by Kingdom Come or it's Albuquerque, one or the other. It's hard to tell. Uh, you know, it's over around that way. Uh, where are you still going? Uh, anyway. That's going fine. But how is this now? 19 gold a piece, then 10 for. <sighs> I think that price may have gone up. I'm not sure. You know, I'm not even going to think about that right now. Okay, that's cool music. The da 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 da, or wh whatever it was, was cool. Uh... Okay, there's actually some up here. A little expensive, but mm, that's fine. Uh, prevents player the player from being dazed while mounted in the broken aisles. Duration is quadrupled for players trained in leather working. Wonder if those kind of things actually sell much beyond outside of this questing. I could get, like, go make demon steel stirrups if I wanted. And I wonder if people would actually buy them, because they go for over a grand, and I could make a fair few. Okay, I got the barding. Uh, I'll wait a moment. Deliver into point. It 
So this is how I'm going to get my high lord mount. Took me fucking long enough. And I think maybe completing this will get me, well, me to move on with the Broken Shore stuff. Considering you, there's no follow-up here, it seems. I would have to assume the follow-up will, will come after we complete this. We must go down yep. and we are all that stands and I will one day do, you know, those other quests. I've been meaning to do it for ages and I just keep forgetting that they exist. Okay. I really should do those quests. It would add to the lore, it would be important. Why can't I bring myself to do it? I don't know. Also, demon spaceships. I still can't get over that. It's just like, suddenly, demon spaceships! And due to the way the, the jumping thing w looks, all I could see was StarCraft. The, the in, like, Legacy of the Void, they added in, like, jumping for, like, the warp jump, well, not warp jump, but, like, uh, tactical, evasive jump thing for, uh, battle cruisers. So, all I can see is that on the demon cruisers, on the demon ships. And going for the fact I've just been, you know, churning through StarCraft at the time. Like, I'd just finished Legacy of the Void. And, like, I've been playing StarCraft 1, Brood War, Wings of Liberty, Heart of Swarm, Legacy of the Void, one after the other, for, like, a couple of months. You know, <laughs> it was just, um, I just found it funny. And I did decide with my door car last play last uh, last night that I would be playing some Warcraft tree soon. But I want to do another Total War Warhammer playthrough, and before that, I want to finish my uh, Mountain Blade Warba uh, Warband Viking Conquest campaign. Uh, it's the story thing. I want to finish that first. Uh, it's almost to do list. for a moment you could actually see to do list at the top but um yeah i want to um f uh, finish one yeah i want to finish the viking conquest thing then do another total war playthrough then go and do warcraft 3 and frozen throne at a later stage i'll be going back to doing them a second time but post warcraft 1 and 2. it's i, I was want to do them those two first but it's going to be a pain in the ass getting them and it's there's always a possibility that it won't work. So I rather than delaying any longer, I want to do them now. So yeah. Well, how goes the search for the barding? Find anything suitable yet? Grayson, uh, Grayson examines the barding. This is well a good start, I would. But I think it will have to be strengthened a bit. Uh, one second, folks. Hello, hello, folks, and I'm back. Hopefully I can be heard just fine. Uh, so I ended up, the mic ended up getting a little adjusted during that pause. So I'm paranoid it's slightly off now. Recording locally, locally. Locally. All as well. Uh, read that? Uh, should we wish to make this barding worthy of the steeds who will bear it, we'll need to upgrade it. Right now, it's just good enough for, for not getting you kicked off your mount. Speak, speak with Allard Schmied in Dalaran. He's a fine smith and will know how to modify this barding into something more befitting of our, our needs. The Hammer of Dalaran. Sounds like, you know, the you know guy with a big mace rather than the blacksmith. Though it does fit, it does, does make sense. Just the hammer of Dalaran sounds like a big guy with a big mace, you know? More so than the place's blacksmith. But it does fit. Ban Wu, Grand Master's Companion. And they have sore fight speed for some reason. Not sure why. Uh, talk to you. Stained pamphlet. No. Uh, 
no, I have no interest in the Botarium. It seems completely worthless. Um, Palamai, welcome back. Don't you just love this smell of hot steel in the morning? Oh yeah, it's the only thing that gets me hard anymore. Uh huh. Greetings, Howard. What can I do? Uh, what can I help you with? You explain what you need to Howard as he looks over the barding. I see. I can certainly help you with upgrading this, but I'll need a few things first. Lately, I've I've been working with the ore of this land, Waystone. It's called. It. I found its remarkable qualities. Uh, I found its remarkable qualities to hold. Uh, uh, found its qualities to hold remarkable strength and durability. We'll need a lot of it for this. There's fell slate, but that's probably too tainted for what you're looking to do with this barding. I know. I. You know, I'll select to adorn my pieces with something sparkly, like a jewel. Uh, I've heard that the elves of Surmar are particularly beautiful ones. Perhaps you can acquire one for this project. Surmarian Sapphire. Uh... Okay, back to Sur fucking Mar. Ugh. All right, all right, Chief. Uh, warp Weavers, Swagus. Uh, think you're a trendsetter? Visit Warp Weaver Tuvus. Riding trunks modifier to enter the trial of style. I'll deal with you eventually, Travert. Uh, one day. It's actually really weird. They were saying, like, oh, we have no idea about these guys. We don't know who they are. We've never met them before. But we invited them to, to the fucking found reef of forging of the Knights of the Silver Hand. It doesn't make sense. It's as if they forgot that part. Unless, of course, they never met up. But isn't the quite, like... I know, it just... Maybe I'm jumping the gun. Maybe I'm assuming there's an issue when there isn't. Hopefully that's the case. I prefer to be wrong than to be right in this situation. I could do this, but I've done it too much. I've done it too much. Ugh. I'm sorry, it's just painful. Also, he says, I'll need a ton of ore. It's just like, I need 25 bits. And it's just like, really? I eat more for breakfast. <laughs> I shit out forged bars. Let's actually, well, uh, speaking of that, let's he head over to the blacksmith. I've been doing plenty of mining as of late, and of such, I've gotten um, a bit of gubbins. Potion of energy. Uh, increasing success, success chance by 30% a mission shorter than 4 hours. Yeah, maybe I could make uh, Lady uh, Leodrin into that. A short mission person. Train me. Uh, no goods. Uh, oh, well, I have plenty for this. So, one, two, three, four, five. Hmm? I have prophecy. Shit. I don't have enough of that. I don't have any of that. How the hell do you get Eye of Prophecy? What, do I have to go raid the, um... Oracle Delphi? Do I have to, you know, DI Oracles? Meh. Just gotta go find my, t you know, time machine. Like, I got no, you know, I got no issue with that. Um, I actually remember hearing a weird story about the Oracle Delphi. It was claiming that it was actually meant to be... It was, it was a weird story in Horrible Histories. Um, a lord wanted to test which Oracle was meant to be the most accurate. It was, to be, it was the most accurate. So he did a weird thing and went out, asked his servants to go ask the Oracles what was he doing. When they went to all the, all the Oracles, but the Oracle Delphi got it wrong. Apparently, Oracle Delphi knew what he was doing. He was boiling a turtle in its shell in a pot with a lid on. And the, the Oracle got it right. How they knew? What the hell have I now? 
like the idea that they actually had spies in the household, or the story is just complete bollocks. Good, you know, could go many away. <sighs> okay. Uh, you. The Magistrix thugs are impeding the lean's efforts to distribute. Magistrix is dead. Uh. Go over this way, and I need to commit Grand Theft Gem. Oh, actually, I I actually buy it, huh? I'm gonna just steal it. Why can't I interact with you? Here, let me get it up your arse. I sell all manner of wares. Five hundred? Christ. The jewel's cut allows it to trap light within it, giving off a cool blue glow. Bastard. I will eat your family. Um... Okay, back to, um... Actually, what does this give? 17.7? Christ. Uh, that could be nice. How am I doing on this? Didn't lose too much. And um, we'll lose a bit more when I eventually decide to go back and get that. Though I don't know how much I prophecies will cost. I want to level all these up to three, but I'm not sure if I can give enough of a shit to do so. I wish they really continued on making these skeleton keys, because they're fucking useful. Because I have so many chests here that I just can't unlock till I get that rogue up. Can I be honest? I'm actually kind of tempted at making all these items so I can get their transmog. Just so I can ha fill out the list. Because I swore I should have more. <laughs> it's a butter knife. Okay. I have no idea how you're meant to pronounce that. Okay. Alright. New. Not that. Oh, to be honest, I think I need, almost need to take a deep breath here. My commentary is just kind of faltering. I don't know why, I just suddenly, I'm just like, how do words? Mm. Um. <laughs> anyway. Hmm. Okay, here. Give me a sec. I will take that break. BRB. Hey, folks, and I'm, I'm, and I'm back. Didn't actually disappear for too long, but hopefully, I actually know now how to string two words together. Will be an accomplishment for me, I feel. Uh, recording Goku, 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 Goku. Line across, line up, line that way, line that way, line. Uh, Everything's fine. I doubt you'll have a problem getting the laystone, but the sapphire might be a bit more, a bit harder to acquire. You got them. Now to upgrade your barding. They ever say a blacksmith can't improve on a letter worker's work, I always say. I mean. They ever say a blacksmith can't improve on a letter worker's work, I always say. I mean, never. I mean, well, you know what I mean. He's, he's a metal worker, not a word worker. He's a metal smith, not a word smith. Uh, let's begin, shall we? I mean, I'll be doing all the work, but you get to watch. I'll already grin at a wild smile at you and begins working. Have a good one. Hey there. Ooh, I can learn this off of